so I'm at my last question. Have you realized your dream project? But, um, when I was a young artist, I dreamt of making a show at the Louvre. I did it. When I dreamt the first time I went to Istanbul and I went to the Yerbatan, I said, I'd love to install my work. I did that. Um, you. I'd love to make sets for an opera one day. You know, the, the sets for an opera. That's I something love, I, I love know. opera. Yeah, I love opera. I'd love to make sets for opera. Uh, we're building, so I'd love to build. Um, and yeah, the, the dreams, I, I hope, I still hope to have new dreams tomorrow yeah so uh, you can follow on instagram and see what's happening and uh so uh yeah now we've got to start then thinking about the future yeah it was uh it was great to uh, to to to know you johan such a uh, such a brilliant, uh, colorful artist and a life story. And, uh, you know, you. this, uh, how I can make you bigger. I, I'm so bad with, uh, <laughs> with uh, techniques here. Uh, uh, what do you want to do? <laughs> I, I wanted to have you on the big screen. That's on. I'll <laughs> Okay, so, okay. You know, it's not a coincidence that uh, I, I invited uh, here to you. I was so happy uh, to, to, to have discovered you, your works in, in, in Plevneli. Uh, I just, uh, before saying goodbye, I just want to say also, how you, you met with Murat Plevneli? How this uh, connection uh, arise and this idea of... Uh, I, I don't really remember. I think it was through Instagram. I think it was through Instagram that he saw images of my work and that he, uh, and then we, I, I think we got in touch that way and that he had seen other things. Uh, I have a vague souvenir, but maybe, yeah, I, I think it was through Instagram. That's the funny thing that there are a lot, quite a few recent stories that all have their, their, um, their links to uh, Instagram. Yeah. But maybe there are questions from yes, anybody. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, let's let's ask to the audience. Please, if you have questions, uh, you may ask. Type or how do they? Uh, if they chat, uh, write on chat. I don't see any questions, but uh, I have usual students asking questions. Uh, yeah. Anybody uh, can ask. Uh, I don't know. Murat Plevnil was. Uh, was trying to connect. I don't know, at some point he, he was with I us. I saw that uh, Asla, I think, is Asla, no? But anyway, uh, with Murat, it's, it's like I said, it's, a, it's, a, it's a, an exciting story. It's a risky story because, the, you know, the whole situation of the world and of Istanbul and of, it's a complex situation. But I've always, I've taken risks and uh, I continue. When I did the, the show with uh, Perrotin in Hong Kong, we were in the middle of the revolution of the, the umbrellas. Yeah, it's a risk. And then you go on and you go to the next project. But um, a lot of the people I've been, it's dealers have to, uh, it's all about trust. Exactly. If trust is broken, then you have a, a sad story. But uh, you can see, uh, uh, uh, it's it's very important to uh, most of the relationship I have are long term relationships. In the art world today, a lot of the things are very quick. They go, you know, very quick. People change. Uh, I believe, still believe in long-term relations. 
I believe in things towards the future. Uh, I see. Yeah, the, yeah there is, there is, there yeah. is Tefik. Tefik, ask your question. Okay. No, he said it's it's more a comment than a question. Always an inspiration. Thank you, uh, Ian. I think I met Ian in America uh, at a university. So. Uh, uh, Batan is going to ask a question, uh, and uh, there is another comment. Uh, Batuhan says, a great storyteller as he is an artist. Thanks sincerely, Mr. Johan. It was a brilliant session. Love the way you created bridges between your own experiences and the teachings. Okay, yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, that good. Uh, Watan was uh, was uh, raising hand. Uh, Watan, you may ask your question. Hello. Thank you, Professor. Uh, just thank you again, sir. So uh, your your camera is closed, Tefik. I, and we don't hear him anymore. Okay, Tefik, ask your question. Yes, can you hear me now? Yeah. Very good. Uh, I yeah, I just just wanted to thank you. Such an inspiration again. Like the comments in the section. The question I had heard you talk about uh, working on the networks more than the business, and. Uh, Professor Sedgkin was talking about the hubs, you know, the more, uh, the areas where not consumers, but appreciators of art are more, um, they have a more discerning taste. When you share your art in places that aren't metropolitan areas, how do you feel the feedback and reception is to your pieces? Uh, it's always a bottle thrown into the water. What I mean is you put your artwork out there and you don't know how it changes life. You, uh, wow. I think the, the thing is you can, that's why I started with the example of Jan Hut in a provincial town. He changed thousands of lives. Uh, so you don't know what the, uh, I know, for instance, I, I, I, I went to a, um, I went to a small town of ceramic artists in the center of France, uh, called La Borne and, uh, their potters and artists living in very still rather rough circumstances. And they have a rather difficult life, most of them. And I told them about um, I told them about Instagram. Um, I told them about uh, taking their own life in their own hands, not waiting for the dealers, not where. And I've seen how some of these artists in four years have reached an audience that they never had before, but. Maybe that doesn't really answer your question, but I, I mean, we don't know as artists, we put the things out there and then you've got to hope for the best. I, yesterday I got a, by Facebook, a message from an older woman and she showed me a piece that I had made also as a, a student that she had inherited from her grandfather. But, it means that the pieces themselves have to be able to speak when I am dead. Exactly. Does that Thank answer your question or not? Yes, it was a beautiful reply. Thank you, sir. I, I, I understand. Okay, Özge, you have a question, Özge? Excellent. Um... How can I uh, actually? I saw your piece in the Art Week's Akarat uh, last week uh, okay. before it closed, and like it was like very moving because I could see or feel uh, it, but it has like so much depth to it, uh, even with its dimensions and the, the reflections of the color of the gold. Uh, so I want to thank you for that, for firstly. Uh, and I was wondering if you are thinking uh, about 
doing a piece related to Turkey or anything inspiring you from our region? But the, the, it, it's a very good question because uh, the, the fact is I've, I've, when I've lived in Mexico, when I've lived in Miami, when I've lived all over the place, how much do you, uh, do you digest of your life somewhere and how much do you then put into the work? And that's certainly true for Istanbul in, in how far or Turkey, how, how, is there something from, from, from Turkey that will surface in my work? I don't know. In any case, I don't make work um, uh, on command. Uh, what I mean is, it's not, I'm going to make something about Turkey or I'm going to do something about, no, it's more like, will this, what we are doing today, will, Will my love for Turkey, will my love for Turkish culture, uh, will it somehow find uh, an expression in my sculpture? I think that's almost certainly the case. I think it will happen. Yeah. I can't wait to see. <laughs> Great. Thank you for your Thank answer. You. Thank you. Any other questions? If not, we can wrap up. Uh, Aslı ask a question. Uh, Aslı Pamir. Yeah. How, How about, about Istanbul Valva? Yes. Yeah. Who knows? Who knows? Yeah. Who knows? It's, uh, you know, th those pieces. Um, when I showed, uh, one of those wall pieces in, in Dubai, we couldn't wor use the word vulva. I mean, I showed the piece, it's an abstract piece. There's nothing that says vulva, uh, except that when you look at the piece, you know that it's about women, it's about sexuality, it's about liberty, it's about strength. But in Dubai, you cannot use the word vulva. I mean, art is also, uh, that's why it's so um, dangerous in some societies. It is that we talk, we, we use words, we talk about things that you, that are dangerous for some people. So it's, it's about liberty. And also the fact is that's why the market is dangerous. The market, because of the fact that it wants to sell products, it is afraid of meaning. It's afraid of, so it, it's about finding a balance between liberty and still living. And, that's also a long answer on a short question, Asle. But uh, yeah, I, I, I'd love to come back to Istanbul. I hope that I, I will be able to come back to Turkey soon. Come, come to Istanbul. I will find out your beautiful studio. Yeah. I Fair. promise. <laughs> okay, wonderful. It was so great talking with you all. Thank you. Thank you very much for, for accepting uh, this caprice. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, you know, being an economist, you, maybe you have, you have asked yourself, uh, what she's going to ask to me? Why, uh, you know, as an artist, what, I, what I'm doing in this class? Uh, but you, you have added a lot to us. Uh, you are one of my, uh, you know... Uh, yeah. Star artist yeah. that I, I follow you, I love you, I, okay. I, I well, you know, I admire you. you. Blush, you make me blush. Yeah. Uh, and I, I, I want to see all these shows in person, all around the places. Having a small apartment in Paris, I, <laughs> I, I hope to visit uh, soon. Uh, uh, to Montreal. Our, our new yeah. studio too. Okay, fantastic. Okay, uh, if this is it, yeah. 
Thank you. This is it. Uh, I mean, thank you okay. from my heart, all my heart. I will send you the link. And I, yeah, yeah. Uh, I will send you the link. And uh, also, uh, with your permission, I want to share close clips, uh, short clips of these videos on, on the YouTube channel right. of this course uh, so that uh, no whatsoever. get some subtitles, right. Turkish subtitles, so right. that uh, all these Turkish artists and Turkish right. art market participants listen yeah. to you, all, all art lovers. Thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, have you. a nice evening in Paris. Thank you. Um, so thank you, Maywa, for all your help. Uh, you were extremely uh, efficient uh, with organizing all the uh, bulletins and mails. Uh, and I have to meet you uh, also uh, in, in Paris. Yeah. Uh, so uh, it's hard to say uh, that this is the end, uh, and, but I'm happy I, I asked all the questions I, I wanted to ask. And uh, you know, now it's time to have a, a good uh, glass of wine. So. <laughs> uh, yes, some, some water. Okay. Okay. Good night. Thank you so much. Good night. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Okay, my students, uh, I, I thank you. Uh, I thank you to, to all of you. Uh, I, I'm sorry, I, I kept you a little bit uh, long this afternoon, uh, this evening. Um, so uh, see you in two weeks with two big, big collectors from one from London, one from New York. Uh, I'll let you know who they are uh, soon. Um, başarılar sınavlarınızda. Good luck in your uh, midterm exams. Teşekkürler. İyi akşamlar. Teşekkürler katılanlara da. Hoşçakalın.